Hey guys, today we're back from another video. So I'm gonna be teaching you guys how to do the most insane sync on DaVinci Resolve. So yeah, let's get straight into it. So firstly, um, when you open up a project, go into the um settings wheel, and then you change your timeline resolution to custom, and then um, two five sixty by fourteen forty. And then change this to 30 FPS. And then save. And then just what we're gonna do is find a clip. I'm just gonna use this clip because I'm jumping in this. And then unlink the clips and delete the audio. And then drag in your song. I'm gonna use Bruce Wayne. And what you want to do is mark some beats on your song. So, yeah. And then you want to find your, yeah, kill beat drop. And then you want to find about like four to three beat drops. So, mine is going to be right there. And then, yeah, so let's listen to it. Yeah, that sounds good, man. And then you wanna line it up when the palettes show up. And then just cut down the song. And let's see. Uh, and then you want to click, um, right click on your clip, and you're open up read time curve. And click on this drop down arrow, and then uncheck read time frame, and then read time speed. And then on every single marquee place, you want to place a keyframe and go five frames back. So I'm going to do that right now. Alright, so once you've done that, just zoom in, and then on the first one, put up all the way to 300, and then and then next after that, you put this to 30, and then put this up, and then drag from here, drag it, and then put this down to 30. And then this to 300. And then just line it up again. And then this to 30. And then 300. Drag it back. And then 30. And then 300. And then line it back up. And then. And then. About 40. Finally. And then close out of time curve. And then make sure you're still on the clip. Return and scaling. And to get that, you just go press inspect in the video. And change the time process to optical flow. And then this to enhance better. And then resize filter to smoother. And play back. Render cache smart. And then render cache color output. <coughs> and this is what you get. And for this to render. And then you should get a really clean sink. 
So, um, yeah, that's basically it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. But I can't stand her, huh? She don't mean my standards, huh? Touching on what she thought was my dick, but that's my glamour, huh?